Hey, what's up guys? This is Brandon Lee with Virtualization How To and uh, wanted to talk to you guys about some easy VMware automation. Now, normally the words easy and automation don't always go together. I know many of you probably have ran into challenges in the past when you wanted to successfully automate your VMware environment and using scripts and using various automation frameworks. Now, there are many great ones out there that I use and uh, we're gonna talk about in future videos. Uh, but I wanted to come to you guys with uh, a detail. If you're running v uh, v Realize uh, Operations Manager in your environment, since version 8.4, there is a new feature found in vRealize Operations that can take your environment to the next level in an easy way when it comes to automation. Now, what is that? Well, as you can see, I have my vRealize Operations screen up uh, for you guys to take a look at. And I am going to navigate in the left pane all the way down to this new dashboard called Automation Central. So if you click on Automation Central, uh, what you're going to see is a calendar that presents itself uh, in your environment. And basically what this new uh, module, if you want to call it, or dashboard inside of vRealize Operations allows you to do is easily create some automated tasks that are infrastructure and operation centric. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, if you take a look at building automated jobs, let's, let's click the button add job. And what we're going to uh, take a look at is the built in actions that come out of the box. So let's go through, I'm going to uh, show you guys uh, how you can easily uh, build out a scheduled task for some automation. So what we can do is we can say, hey, I want to power off idle VMs. So let's, uh, let's just call this power off idle VMs test. Power off idle VMs, and we're going to click Next. And here we want to set the scope so you can't drag which uh, and just simply highlighting the cluster is not enough. So you have to double click it. So once you double click it, it adds it to uh, the scope chooser, so to speak, and then you can proceed to the next screen. So then all we have to do is create a schedule. When do we want this to happen? Do we want this to happen on the weekends? Do we want it to happen throughout the week? Uh, we can also set the recurrence. Uh, we can say this is a one-time thing or we want this to happen daily or weekly. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna say, I want this to happen every week. We're gonna say on Saturday. And we can also set up notifications if we want the scheduler to automatically email us. So we can say create. And then notice how we have, I already have a task set up to delete old snapshots. So hopefully you've enjoyed this. This is an easy way to get started with uh, automation in VMware, uh, in a VMware environment, uh, especially if you, uh, of course, have vRealize Operations Manager. Uh, this new feature, Automation Central, I think is gonna be fantastic addition uh, that administrators, vSphere administrators can make use of. And I'm willing to bet that with the Automation Central, uh, future releases are going to simply build on this functionality that's built into uh, this wizard. Well, I'm Brandon Lee with Virtualization How To, and I, I really hope you enjoying the content that I'm, I'm putting out here. And if you do, let me know about it in the comments section or uh, certainly by subscribing to the channel, uh, liking the video. I uh, really appreciate you guys doing that. So I will see you guys uh, soon.